Welcome back. I'm David Nelson for the Traders Network Show, broadcasting worldwide from the New York Stock Exchange for iHeartRadio and Equities.com. We're here for an event being hosted by the United Nations Sustainable Stock Exchanges Initiative. My next guest is Fiona Reynolds, who's the Executive Director for Principles for Responsible Investment. Fiona, welcome. Thanks so much for being with us. Thanks for having me. Uh, Fiona, I went on the web last night, i got to be honest with you. I went out and I, and I was looking at the PRI and trying to learn more about the organization. And I found that there were 1,300 signatories uh, of the PRI with assets over $59 trillion with a T. That's, that's a powerful voice. Uh, how did you manage to, to make such an accomplishment? What do you plan to do with that voice? Well, it is a staggering amount of money, $59 trillion. It is. I would say that when we're talking about responsible investment, that when people sign on to the principles, the six principles of responsible investment, they uh, agree to put them in place and adopt the principles, which is all about how do you integrate environmental, social and governance factors into your investment process. That doesn't mean that at this stage, every one of those $59 trillion is invested in a sustainable way. People have to get started. It's, um, it's a journey. But I do think responsible investment is an, an inevitable agenda that is just continuing to gather pace and momentum and that there's really no turning back now. When did you first start to you know, work with the SSC and how did that process evolve? So the Sustainable Stock Exchange Initiative is where one of the partners to and we started working with them about five years ago. And it was really from the fact that you, we as investors need information from companies to know what they're doing about incorporating environmental issues, social issues and governance issues. And obviously exchanges have a big role to play in making sure that companies not, can provide that information to investors and the exchanges play a big role in giving guidance. It's a huge marketing job, I would think, you know, for your organisation to get this message out. And, and really to market it to really all the, you know, the members you'd like to bring in and, and have them come on board. Is it a laborious process? How, how do you manage it? And, and how do you target individual companies to come on board? Sure. Well, our um, mission is to create a sustainable financial system. So that means we have to work with all the different actors that are involved. Okay. If you just look at it from one point of view, you're not going to get there. So we need the investors, we need the companies, we need the exchanges, we need all the financial organisations that sit with under so and underpin them. So it's an all-encompassing. It has to be all of them. And that's why the Sustainable Development Goals are really exciting, because they need all actors as well. And they are really aligned with the work that we're doing on the investor side. I want to ask you the same question I've asked uh, all of our guests today. How does the Sustainable Stock Exchanges Initiative and their activities over the next couple of years, how will you integrate that with your organization and what you'll do over the next year or two? So, well, it's very integrated into our work. As it is I, already. It's okay. already integrated. As I said, we need exchanges to show leadership to help companies to be able to be transparent about what they're doing and how they put environmental, social and governance factors into their thinking um, and we need to get more exchanges involved. At this stage we've got a number of exchanges, we've got a lot from the developing world, we've got some from the developed world. Do we have a hard number on that, on the number of exchanges right now? Oh, I want all of them. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it'd be nice if all, if all exchanges around the world worked on the basis that we had sustainable companies who were sitting on them and that they were overseeing sustainable companies. They're going to be here for the long term. That's a big goal. Any parting words to the UN and the SSC before you leave today? Well, it's a great initiative. Uh, I'm really glad. We're really proud to be involved in it. And I just think it's going to go from strength to strength. Fiona, well said. Thank you for being with us. Thank you. Thank you. That was Fiona Reynolds, who's the Executive Director for Principles for Responsible Investment. By the way, a quick thank you goes out to 1-800-PUBLIC RELATIONS for all the PR and media support. Thanks for joining. I'm David Nelson at the New York Stock Exchange.